I am Netmover Fidan. Welcome to my perspective walkthrough. Free downloadable game from Digipen. Yes. That's educational institution. <laughs> Straightforward control setup and I'm guessing orange means death. Well, that was some Matrix time. Now it's Inception. I thought that was some Disney type. Yeah. I can't stray beyond the... Oh wait, perhaps I can. But I need to get the right camera angle and I'll just move in this 2D plane. Right, on to the next arcade game, The Cube. For those who are unfamiliar with DigiPen, it also produced a couple of games which form the basis for Portal. And some key mechanics in Portal 2. Those games are also available free from the DigiPen website. I might check them out at some point. Just to get a little background tour regarding. Regarding Portal and Portal 2. Right. I need to think two dimensionally. And um, yeah. Platformer mode. Orange means death. It also means you can't shift back to camera mode. Yeah, there are two camera modes. I mean, two modes. You know what I mean! Yeah, platformer mode. Which speaks for itself. That's what I'm controlling in a two dimensional plane. And camera mode, where I can alter the. Do I have to say it? You can guess what I'm talking about. Where I can alter the. orange, I can't move the camera that way. Well, I can't shift to platform mode. And as you can see, two-dimensional plane, you can't move a mess. There's nothing in the way. New means you can either stand, or can't move through. Orange, death. Space, you can move through as long as you're not too big. 
as it fits. And that's obviously the accents. Guess the theme for this. And some simple mistakes that can be made. And this game is a little of a Jew, as I haven't discovered until fairly recently I hit that. released on the 12th of December 2012. Yeah, so I think a walkthrough of this is long overdue. In this game that probably has some inspiration from a Dutch artist known as Escher. Dutch artist did some drawings which were how can I put it impossible to make in the physical world. Yeah. Specifically buildings and other situations. Yeah, the farther away you are from the blue nights. Running into orange. Platformer mode equals death. Whichever angle you look at it. Just running into it is enough, or falling into it. I'm surprised if he didn't get this. Some people would prefer to hear tone deaf singing from those willing to humiliate themselves. South Koreans considering StarCraft to be a sport. Not that's a bad thing, though. Time show rejects are... Things right, even if their lives depended on it. Yes, they should. Because then it would provide additional motivation. <laughs> yes. Perhaps they should have a battle royale type type scenario. Yes. If you 
are unfamiliar with Battle Royale. Right, I'll watch the movie. Or if you want, read the source material. Battle Royale has source material. It basically involves a group of Japanese teenagers killing each other. I would spoil too much though. There are quite a few fun bits of that. Right, time to continue through this tastelessly decorated arcade. Yeah, the walls are all nice. But the carpet, come on! No last if the clowns were moving in yet. Yeah. That's what I was saying about zooming in to make small enough to fit the gap. And now, big enough to jump over this. Is a solution. It's just a matter of finding the right angle. Huh. There's the exit. Just need to find a way up there. style and turning a real time strategy game into a sport. Well, certainly more exciting than watching cricket. Well, at least as far as I'm concerned. That puts me to sleep every time I try and watch it. 